Wow, it was warm in those coats. Super warm. So um, we're going to do extras because there's a few interesting things here. Bonus. Bonus. What do we got? The casting of Heavy Rain. That's cool. It, fucking concert art. No, let's, let's do the casting. It's like a video of it. Oh yeah, they like a made a name? thing. I can't hear anything they're saying. My name is Mary Smith. I'll turn it up. I'm 24. Have you ever taken any acting lessons, Mary? Not really. I couldn't afford it, but I watch a lot of films and I learn so much by watching them. Have this you shot is like an E3 trailer. Really? I've had a few bit parts, little things here and there. And casting I'm couch. Very curious for the moment. I'm always tall. To yes, it right is casting head. couch. <laughs> and this is okay. Okay. Do you remember those your teeth? Yes. Do you remember um, the Kara E3 trailer Market that eventually evolved into That's Detroit from like three years ago? Okay. Well, they made like a non-canon to Detroit trailer of like Kara being pulled apart and, and back together. That's neat. Um, that's what this is like. This is not actually part of Heavy Rain. They, this is just like them promoting the game by saying, "Look what we can do with the PlayStation 3." It really doesn't look good. Well, coming off the PS2, this looked fucking phenomenal. The PS2 and the GameCube. Get ready to censor. And then you came up to me. You looked at me straight in the eyes. I'm ready. I have censorship ready. I really want our subtitles back. Because she's French. Yep, it is porn. All of also, this is porn. the way the teeth are like, they're like, they're like giant Yeah, teeth. the teeth are wrong. Like, ah. But real life, ah. it never ends up being what you think it's going to be. You think it's going to be one big happy fairy tale. Someone, someone cut that face and out and use for something. I know you guys will. One day you wake up in an average little house, leading an average little life, and your real dreams are about paying the bills and maybe someday getting a bigger TV. Did you realize that... You sound boring, lady. Maybe that wasn't the life you were dreaming of. You realize maybe things could have been Boogie different. Yeah. And maybe I actually could have lived with all of that, but then one day it all just stopped. It starts with something small. A little lipstick on a collar. A few nights when you come home a bit late. At first I tell myself that I'm crazy. This that you would never do house? such a thing. But just like tweeze my mind. Act? One night I follow you as you leave the oh, office. I follow you to the CG hotel. French fucking Where you meet the girl. And then my whole world falls apart. Yep. Fucking French leaves. <laughs> yeah, this is quite literally just to show off. I get the gun the, from the drawer in the bedroom. How amazing the PS3 was. And I tell Why do you store your gun in the sink? That if this is all that life has to be. Good place to hide it since men never clean up. Then I can do without. What? <laughs> I clean more than you. In fact, you're supposed to do the dishes tonight. I'm gonna do the but dishes then I after the mind. show, Dev. The fucking. I'm not the one who's cheating. Oh, so, nice, agree. Quietly, you should come home. I with wait for you. So you can be girlfriend material. Sitting in my average little kitchen. Well, if you want, you would do that. Home, if only I wasn't making all the money. So I press the fucking gun against your forehead, and I take a few seconds to watch the fear grow in your eyes. You tell yourself. She won't do it. She doesn't have the guts. She's just trying to teach me a lesson. But you are so wrong, honey. I sentence you to death for yeah. turning my life into a soap opera cliche. For stepping on my dreams. For not giving a shit about me all those years. And for lying Jesus. to me and betraying me and humiliating me. Yeah, French is fucked, dude. An example oh, yeah. For all the assholes out there who think they can keep on fucking Yeah, this over. shot became iconic. Mm-hmm. People were saying, Heavy Rain's gonna be the big... And they used, like, this... This frame of, like, her holding the gun. Yeah. It was really nice right there. Yeah. So, how was it? So, obviously, this is played by the actress that... Yeah. ...played the... You think yeah. I might stand yeah, the hooker. Someone would get in touch with you and let you know. It looks awful, but it looked... It was great back then. Yeah. She wasn't Remember, guys, huh? the PS2 was, like, just... It doesn't matter. ...blocks, it's the basically, <laughs> the graphics. <laughs> Well then. And yeah, see? Motion capture. Also, yeah, very French. Look at that name. Okay, maybe... I forgot the concept, right? That's just whatever. Drags on. Um, how about that? 
see this shit. Okay. If the deleted scenes aren't on disk, and they should be, I know where to get them on YouTube. We can quickly go get them. We can use like the in, the in YouTube thing. Boobs. Is that Madison? I think so, because they pull her hair back. I think it's Madison too. Yeah. Kind of got like the, the mannish jaw just yeah, a little bit. Yeah, there you bit. go, it's Madison. Yeah, it's Madison. Neat. Yeah, see, so they motion capture this whole game. Yeah. That was a fake audition? Probably. Oh, so for Uncharted, the guy that played Odo in DS9 did motion capture for his character. Really? And I saw I saw like a behind the scenes like this, and he's like running around like in like a skin tight suit. Love it. And it's like, Jesus, Odo. Oh! Yeah, they, they, they mo capped the whole thing. Awesome. Plus, this is really loud. Hold on. Is there any particular reason the actress is screaming? Uh, because if they're doing motion capture, it like, it helps. 172 days of shooting, fuck me. Well, yeah, man. Because you gotta, you gotta do all the different choices too, right? Yeah. So like, and d you've seen how many QTEs there are. Yeah. Like. Well, I think if they're, if they're acting, it just, it just helps them get into it. Probably. Like. I've seen a lot of voice actors do movements when they when they voice act. Yeah, but most people move them. when they talk. Yeah. So. Like throw punches and stuff, like if they're fighting. I think voice actors do that. Okay. See, it looks like they are. No, see, they're they're motion capturing their faces. See, look at that. You know what? I think that it was just because that lady was blonde. Mm. Straight up, just because she was blonde, that her face went together and like her hairstyle. Yeah, but Madison's hair didn't really work on her. Yeah. Well, okay. And also, like I mean, all the animations were like a little bulky. Yeah, they were. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah so. Well, here, here's, here's the, the the funny thing though. David Cage has like a serious fetish for for girls with short dark hair, because mm -hmm. every single game he's made, a character has short dark hair. That's just his fucking thing. A new fair, I get it. Short dark hair is pretty nice. Yeah. Dad! Hey, Dad! take it easy. You're gonna knock <laughs> me over. Uh, so this is your big day, huh? Am I grown up now? <laughs> no, you're Ten dead, old, you bitch. Exactly the guy who played Connor in Detroit, anyway. when David Cage asked his favorite party, he said the scene where he says, I like dogs, and that pissed off David Cage. That's funny. Uh, Wait, what? That's Ethan. No, no, I meant the dog um, scene. What? Was, the what? Was given to I don't remember I either. Have, uh, I don't remember either. And Ethan as well. Sean may be dead in a few hours. He seems kind of like Ethan, eh? He, he wants to punish me for Jason's death. I, see, I, I'm, I'm the one who, who, sh who should have died. I, I, I wanted to save him. I would have done anything to give my... My, my life. His accent's kind of coming through in the audition, yeah. I couldn't. Foul most, so they have beaks. <laughs> Another day goes by that I, I don't see his face. Now, Sean has got nothing to do with that, no, nor do any of the other children. I, this yeah, has Scottish, to stop. Huh? You've got to hand yourself into the police. Look, if I hand myself into the police, I lose all chances of finding Sean. They'll question me, but, but I won't be able to tell them anything because I don't know anything. I don't know what happened. Ethan, you may have killed those children. You don't know what you're capable of. You must end yourself oh, in. I have to save Sean at all costs. He may be uh, a prisoner somewhere, and I'm the only one who knows where. If, if I have to face up to all these trials to prove to myself that I love my son, then I'll do it. Ethan, it's crazy. You have to end yourself in. I'll hand myself into the police when I have found Sean. Now, don't... Promise me you, you won't inform on me until I have found my son. Recent report indicates that the police are now treating this as another... Ooh. Hello there, sweetheart. I'd like a room. Michael Nettie for ICN. For you? Anything. Gross. That's for sure. Um, I'm 25. Mm -hmm. I've been modeling for five years. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't mean to get into modeling at all. I was scouted on the street. I was shopping with my mom. Are they all from the UK, yes, all the actors? Me. 
I thought they were all French, Dev. Well, the, the, the minor characters were, like the, like the kids and stuff. But the first guy was Scottish, and this, she seems to be English. I, can you scroll back up? There was something I wanted to read. Just a little bit. I didn't realize what was happening straight away. Go back down. Head cries from behind me. Everyone started running in slow motion. I That's slow neat, butter. Yeah, that is, yeah. I hadn't noticed the detonator in his hand. Your vast experience hasn't prevented eight victims from being murdered. <laughs> Fucking asshole! <laughs> Fucking like, asshole! You've got a plan. I'm willing to listen. Don't be shy. I'm all ears. <laughs> he looks so. He looks. Um, the last thing I did not like his character. <laughs> like at all. It's so weird. Maybe it's because he looks less drugged out. You beat him all night to make him talk. He would have confessed to Kennedy's assassination if you asked him. Your confession is a heap of shit. <laughs> Quarter is not the origami. Yeah, it seems. The origami. You know, you know what? I actually appreciate it. Like, oh, watching this actually makes me kind of realize that I actually appreciated Norman's, like, voice acting and, like, actor. Because he was one of the few people that actually put, like, a lot of, like, actual exaggerated emotion into his yeah. lines, which is kind of what you need when you're voice acting. Like you can't really communicate with your eyes as much, right? So. I bought ten minutes of your time, didn't I? All I ask is that you use that time to answer some questions. So? Exactly the same. <laughs> He's got an earring, though. Just what it? Gay. No, it's just very He's cute and real? Yeah, I agree, Mr. JD. I, I think it's just because he doesn't look so drugged out. <laughs> well, I was a cop for 20 years, and one fine day, my wife decided to uh, run off with, uh, you know, so... You... You should see all the faces of the husbands when they first discover that I know that they have a mistress. It's like a little kid, their hand caught in the cookie jar. You know, I she really never smiled that much though. My salary. Yeah, he did. You know, yeah. But they were just like short, quick mm -hmm. smiles. Mm -hmm. Just to keep quiet. Fourteen casting sessions. Jesus. That's the old lady. That's Blake. That's that, uh. There she is. Yeah. She has big teeth in real life. <laughs> oh, yeah. I knew she did. But, like, they made them, like, poor. Whew. Who's that? creepy. Oh, was that the creepy perv man? Yeah, we ran away from. Scott Shelby's not cute in real life. My favorite part <laughs> is that Scott Shelby looks exactly the same. Yes, it's not here. Okay, let's head out to the PlayStation 4 menu and go to the YouTube. It's really easy to get it, so... Damn, dude. Pretty, I'm pretty sure it's under TV and video, isn't it? I don't fucking know. You should know, Dev. Oh, fuck, it's not downloaded on this computer. Probably not. Oh, no. <laughs> By the way, I want to buy Game of Thrones on this. <laughs> yes. Fuck. No, it's downloaded on the, on the other PS4. There's YouTube trending, but not YouTube. No, 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 no. The, the other PS4 has the YouTube app downloaded. I guess this one doesn't. But what if I just... What if I just... Click on a thing and then try to search from there. You can try that. Yeah, click on it. Can I find the application? Yeah. Okay. Just, no, just go, go. Okay. Yeah. You'd be like, download YouTube. But hopefully it won't take you long. You can all watch how to train your dragon three. Yes. YouTube. Download. Press it. Hopefully it's a small app. We can get it done in a minute. Yeah, I completely forgot that it was on the other PS4. Yeah, Jeff. Sometimes I'm better prepared than this. Not all the time, though. That's taking for fucking ever. Look at that. Do 
Yeah, you know what we'll do? He head back out if you don't mind to the, the main menu. It'll take a minute or two. Yeah, if you if you go into TV, just go back, 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 back. go into TV and video. Yeah. Okay, yeah, just head back out. And just wait. G give me, give me, I'll just take it. I'll just take the power away from you. Head back out. Go back to TV and video. Yep, head sorry. back out, Dev. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, so that, okay, that'll take about two minutes, I think. So, I think it's something we wait. La la la. No, no, no. Let's actually kind of unwind from from heavy rain a minute. What's your final thoughts on the game? I like it. Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure if I'll play it again. Oh. But I like it. Didn't you want to play Detroit again? Yeah, but I wanted to. That was just so I could do like a full, like actual, like actual, like. Um. Full, like actual, like actual, like. What's that word for Connor? The one. The oh, deviant. Yes, that. <laughs> I knew it started with well, a D. <laughs> Christmas home movies. Well, the difference though was that in Detroit, at the end of every level or whatever, mm -hmm. every segment, it gave you like the tree of choices you could make mm -hmm. to get to other other like timelines or whatever, mm -hmm. other runs. You don't get that in Heavy Rain. No. You don't get to see. No, I think Detroit's playthrough. like a better game. Just, yes, I think Detroit. It, I think story-wise and just it's set like it's it's above but close at least for me personally because like there's just lots of things I was nitpicking about in Detroit anyway and like mm -hmm. there yeah. wasn't as much nitpicking story-wise for me in this one but it's not as good of a story. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree with that. See, there's some of, of the good plot somewhere in there if it was actually competent writers and directors behind it. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Yeah, like as, as it turns out. Yeah, no, this was yeah, that was definitely just a lot of a lot of the, that game was cliche. This game, he yes. Heavy Rain. A lot of Heavy Rain was yeah. very cliche. Well, it was kind of like his first, his first kind of big project though. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, no, okay. Detroit first of all had obviously better graphics because it's a newer game, right? Mm -hmm. Um, the gameplay in it was was in fact better. Slightly. E slightly, but even like the idea of putting in. The flow chart at the end of every level that was cool. ma made it a lot, I'm a telling, lot easier. I'm yeah. telling you guys, play Heavy Rain and then play Detroit, and the quick time events in Heavy Rain were a lot easier. Easier, really? Easier in Heavy Rain? Yes. Not harder? No. Okay. They were a so, lot so Detroit's easier. harder? Yeah. Okay. The quick time events were yep. harder. I failed a oh. lot more at the quick time events in Heavy Rain. The Not in Detroit. The story in both games is by the books, but, but Detroit's is slightly more interesting. But, like, both of them failed at execution. Yeah. But both of them failed at execution. There wasn't any tilting of their control in Detroit to become human? Good. Yeah. The usual only like what ones seem to be detectives. Yeah, yeah, because, like, playing as Norman Jaden was quite fun. And playing as Connor was quite fun. But yeah. the rest of the game was just kind of eh. Yeah. Yeah. But honestly, I found... Actually, Ethan Mars is alright to play. No, Ethan Mars was fun to play as. Yeah. I actually found playing as the detective kind of boring. Really? You didn't like the whole, like, investigating for clues and, like, using, like, the, the Batman d detective mode? Like, well, since that fucking made us go insane, no. Yeah, well, but, like, in terms of gameplay, it was fun. No, in terms of gameplay, yeah. it was fun. Yes, definitely. I bet you that actually that's where so, the Arkham games got their inspiration from. So, guys, I do have a copy of Beyond Two Souls, which is apparently David Cage's worst game. Yeah? Should we play it? I don't, I don't know. Too. Also, I think that's done. Yeah, it's done. So I'll, I'll go look it up now. YouTube. Oh, no, no. <laughs> You're punished for doing the one fun thing in the game? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't. You can, you butters, see, like after the fact, now that I found that out, I don't like it. Yeah. Butters, the, the 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 detective mode is cool because like you find clues and like things pop up and you're like you're like you're like moving around in like your VR world and then also. I'll, I'll just skip that. Also, what ends up happening is um, in the VR world, work and talk. Um, like like when you're when you're at your desk and you're like, like scrolling through things and you're like this this piece yeah, of evidence goes here. Cool. Like that was all I really like fun. That. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna look up. Uh, heavy rain. Let me just get this real quick. Until so, Dawn is this, the guys. best by far of Western visual novels. I, I saw the Heavy Rain deleted scene thing, and I thought it was seriously going to be on... um. Like, uh, like, why wouldn't it be in the game's... um? 
extras. Sometimes they just don't yeah. do that, you know? But they, they put it up as, as an official video. I don't fucking know. Yeah. That's deep. That's not... Okay, I'm just going to go back one. Hey, go heavy raid deleted scenes, the secrets of the scenario. Okay. You just... Yeah, there you go. Good job, Dev. I'm proud of you. Thanks. Minecraft story mode win. Minecraft story mode is a telltale game. Yeah, I know. Minecraft, yeah. yeah, I know. Mm. You see, this even has like the... Don't worry about it. Why isn't it in the game? Don't worry about it. Sean! In the original version of the game, Shelby entered Anne Shepard's hospital room just after Madison. He hugged her in his arms and then smothered her with a pillow. We decided to exclude this very violent scene. Why? A man who that would have made the game the better. The that would have made the story better. And by extension, the concept of the family cannot kill his mother like that. And although we learn... No, it shows his derangement into madness. It yeah. too radical to envisage Shelby getting rid of his own mother, who is senile to boot, therefore incapable of remembering that he is there. By merely looking at his mother without talking to her, he again becomes the little boy who is desperately seeking a father worthy of the name in a world that has disappointed him. Also, yeah, th this guy seems up his ass with his own story, doesn't he? That That's David Cage. Blackouts, he would find himself in a sort of nightmare, lost in the ruins of a house underwater. Ethan would swim without really knowing where to go, just following the corridors until he came upon the body of the child, the victim of the origami killer. <laughs> He would then wake up, as in the final version, in Carnaby Square, with an origami figure in his hand. What? The first blackout takes place after Ethan puts his son Sean to bed. Once Sean is asleep, Ethan goes back downstairs. But when he reaches the bottom of the stairs, he sees water on the floor at the front door. He turns Damn around right. and sees water coming down the stairs behind him. The water continues to rise. Looking out the windows, we realize that the water outside is already higher than the house. Ethan runs toward the front door of the house. When he gets there, the door literally explodes and an enormous quantity of water submerges Ethan. The I'm second blackout, they took some of this out. which is much more spectacular, happens when Ethan loses Sean in the park. The camera started to tremble more and more and a tsunami suddenly submerged that whole part of the city. Then we found Ethan underwater, as in the previous blackout. Two similar elements for a paranormal explanation. Shelby was present at the time of Ethan's accident, and a special bond was forged between them. From then on, Ethan accessed Shelby's mind whenever he killed children, corresponding to the times when Ethan found himself in the house underwater, filled with Shelby's memories. The water is the metaphorical representation of the killer's mind. During his blackouts, oh. Ethan goes to Carnaby Square, the place where Shelby's brother died, and he makes an origami figure at the same time as the killer makes one to leave in the hands of the victim. These scenes were not retained in the end because they made the story too complex and introduced a paranormal element that added nothing to the story. We decided to remove them a few months before the end of development, particularly in order to speed up the start of the game, recenter the narration, and anchor the story in reality. So you kept the blackouts in the yeah. origami, but not the explanation? Yep. In the morning. He goes to wake up Sean to take him to school. The scene is redundant because of the father and son scene. However, this part of the game was not without interest. It placed the player in the role of a responsible father, looking after his son and himself. As he passes yep. near the letterbox, Blackouts for no reason. Ethan notices the origami killer's letter that informs him that his son will soon disappear. Of course, it is a touching scene, but too close to the father and son and the birthday scene for it to have any real existence of its own. But it would have been nice to have like a, to like almost the letter a in the that father scene, and you know? son scene and to get rid of this scene. Madison is the most enigmatic character in the game. Yeah. We know very little about her, and insomnia is she's undeveloped. Investigating the origami killer. In one of the first versions of the game design, Madison went to her newspaper office several times. At the American Tribune, she could conduct research to find possible suspects. 
speak with her boss, and write articles after her missions. That in sounds the same cool. Way, Madison's apartment was different in the beginning. It was in the process of being redecorated. One of the player's first tasks was to repaint and change the layout of the apartment in order to personalize it. This was an interesting characterization process for a character who still remains quite mysterious. We never learn in the game why Madison suffers from insomnia. In reality, it stems from her past. As a journalist, she was a war correspondent during the armed conflict in Iraq. Yeah, Butters. Fuck me. Wow, this, this is just pissing me off. Mm-hmm. Is that it? That's it. So, uh, so guys, uh, fuck my Kay. life. Also, you said this was going to take a half hour. That was five and a half minutes. Well, no, but, like, the other things that we've done. Like, oh, the, the okay. Other, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. I, 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 knew, just, I knew, yeah. Okay. Okay. So, yeah, um. Wow. I'm, I'm actually pretty angry now. Yeah. That was... Yeah. So, Oof. they kept, like, a stupid thing. Entirely didn't explain it. I'm I'm quite happy they took out the paranormal, the paranormal thing out. Because, honestly, I thought that might have been a thing. But that would have been a twist that I kind of expected and didn't want-ish, yeah. you know? Like, it didn't really match the rest of the game. I, I would have been okay with it. No. And also, it reminded me of Alan Wake. If they had done that. I would have associated it too close with Alan Wake, and since I don't like Alan Wake. No, see, I, I would have been completely fine with it. Can you just frankly. look up at Sean dying so we can at least get the satisfaction of seeing well, that? Well, hold on. Let me talk about this for a minute. See, I would have been fine with, with them introducing paranormal element because mm -hmm. as long as the world's internally consistent, it's it's okay. Yeah, but this right? is David Cage. Yeah, but like, for example, like Shenmue's a great example. Shenmue's a very realistic game internally, mm -hmm. um, but it has, it has like one supernatural element. Mm-hmm. Which is that, like the two mirrors, when they come together, they summon, they, they when they open a portal to hell or something. But everything else about it is is based in reality. So the fact that there's like one mystical element kind of gives it weight in the story, and I think that's actually a good way to do a story. Like when, when there's just magic fucking everywhere, who cares, right? Like that, that's like the problem with like uh, Star Wars, because like there's just Jedi's doing shit all over. It's like it's it's no longer anything special, right? But when there's one thing in the story that's a bit outlandish. It's like a beacon, and I think that the story can focus on that. Yeah, but I find it a distracting beacon. Yeah, it can be. So, the Jason glitch people wanted to see. Why did it? we want to see this? I don't fucking know. Someone said, someone said Jason no, glitch. No, everyone's saying Sean dying. I heard, I saw that too, but they said Jason glitch first. $2, sir. Jason, wait for me. Wait for your dad, son. Sean's going to do Okay. Here. We'll see them both. Look at that kid just... It's still stupid that he just takes off down the fucking road. Wow. Well, I'm still pissed. Yeah. Fuck me, Maverick Hunter X. Rose who? Rose Tico from the new game. Then it's a new, new Star Wars. It is impossible to try on a he was right there, dude. Yeah. Where's Jason? He was here a second ago. I bought him a balloon. I turned around and he just... He's right there, dude. Yeah. Disappeared? What do you mean, disappeared? Stay here. I'll go get him. I'll be right back. He's right there, dude. Jason! Jason! <laughs> it's like... Jason! Hey, kid. <laughs> Oh my fucking god. Can you imagine if this happened to us? What would you have done in Jason! our places? Would have attempted to punch him. Jason! Wow. Jason! Found him. Jason! <laughs> okay. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you said the, the... Sean glitch. Sean glitch? Okay, here it is. Press X to Sean. Let's see what it does. I like how everyone tried to do what I- Oh no, he was able to walk across it. This is time- This is fine. I hope it's not too late. It's fine. The poison's gonna kill me now. 
You know what? This actually makes it almost better. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is most of the movement? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> that happens. <laughs> wow, dude. <laughs> Press X to Sean. I understand that, Marie, but there's still some value in letting your, like throwing your kids outside and say, go play, come back not for dinner. Not in the fucking public mall, it's not. No, that's true. But, like, you grew up in a, in a small town like mine. It was, like, me and my bike. as I like, go see your friends. Like, get out of the house, you know? Yeah, but, like, I understand why lots of parents don't do that. Because, like, I'm fucking anxious if I can't see, like, my dog or even my siblings. Like, when I like when I was taking care <laughs> of them, if I couldn't see them, I was just anxious the entire time. You think he's yelling Sean into his lungs? Yes. God, God, <laughs> right in his ear. Wake him up. Is that a real ending, Leonard Church? Sean dies in it with Madison at the grave. She says she wants you to get her pregnant next time you hang yourself. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> I knew you would come and save me. <laughs> wow. This is fucking amazing. It just, you can't say anything important. Just yell Sean. <laughs> you know, I kind of wish that we had, um, we had gotten the motion controls. Yeah? Yeah, if we had, like, like a PS, a PS move. No, like, I agree, but, like, if they're just, like, going out and playing, like, at a playground, like, like, old enough kids should be able to, like, if they're, like, double digits, yeah, you know, yeah, they yeah. should be able to go to a playground, like, just fine. <laughs> I know who the killer is, Ethan. I can prove your innocence. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Ethan. Oh! Oh, this is a different ending. Look at that. You're the father that I have been looking for all these years. Yeah, because there's no, um... Okay, so Norman Shelby Jane. just doesn't show up. If if Norman doesn't show up, yeah. <laughs> Sean. <laughs> I'm afraid that's not possible. <laughs> Your lady friend knows my little secret. My fucking god. <laughs> What's that, Ethan? Sean is the killer. <laughs> Ethan dies. What? <laughs> He's still yelling it. But oh, she's still... yelling it. Is she? No. I think. It... Okay, I thought she... I thought I heard her no, yell I, it. I think it's coming from his corpse. This is amazing. What's the title of the video, Leonard Church? I'll search it next. <laughs> Hey, 
in the butt. That was definitely in her leg. Butt. Yeah, I can't put in URLs in this, man. So just give me the title. Ouch. Oh, that's the version of the ending you've seen before, by the way. Really? I liked our version better. Yeah, I did too. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> in the distance, Sean. <laughs> oh fuck! She missed again. She missed it again. We did, Torvar. Yeah, we did. Okay, you killed like twenty dudes, Shelby. Yeah. In the fuck? What are you doing? Yeah. See, this makes me happy that we got that other ending and not this one, because this one would have made me extremely angry. Been shot twice. Yeah. Heavy rain, Ethan Mars. Okay. Ethan Mars ending or something? See, that, that's enough him. of this. Yeah, that's he, enough he, of this. It's just him screaming Sean in the distance. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Is there like a way to fast forward it or? I do want to see the. I want to see like the dead body screaming. Screaming. <laughs> he's, like, he's just lying there, just. Sean! Sure! He's not dead. Yeah, he didn't die, I guess. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm done. Sorry, sorry. We'll look at this last video, then I guess we'll call it, because this is dead. Like we, we finished the game half an hour ago. It's time for us to to go to bed, guys. But uh, heavy rain, Ethan Mars endings. This is our indie encore. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look, I'm really confused as to why, like, there's no one there, and. Like, is it, like, and also, I can't tell what time of day it is in this game. It's just too rainy the whole time, man. Yeah. It's probably just one of those days where, like, everything was raining all the time. Yeah, but you could have had, like, during some days, like, it would have been neat if, like, things were going well. You could have, like, kind of sunny days, but, like, with still, yeah. still with rain. Like, all, all, obviously, all the rain would be much heavier at night because that's just the way things go. But, you know, like, like, today... That's 9.55, dude. Today, it was, a. Uh, it was sunny a little bit, and I only got spit on a little bit every every time I left the house. It was great. That's quite loud. Oh, yeah, the kid died. No. Oh, his dad died, but the kid survived. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's see what we can oh, do. Oh, no, wait. Uh, there's Madison. Yeah, and then Madison's with the kid, yeah. Oh, Shelby's alive. Yeah, Shelby survived. I guess Madison didn't survive, so it's just them. Oh. There's, that, that's, when, that's the one that we got where they're yeah. happy ever after. What is... Did you get back with his, his wife? Maybe. I don't know. If you actually watch it, it'd be easier to see. I'm not going to see them all. I just want to see the one where, like... I want to see... One. There. Okay. It was sunny before the kid died. True enough. Sunny day. Yeah, that's true, eh? Yeah, so... Yeah, Don't worry dead. about it, Mr. JD. My memory's shit. Uh, so Sean Mars died. We'll go away from here, Ethan. Somewhere where it never rains. We'll start a new life. You'll get a job as an architect, and I'll work for the local newspaper. And we'll rebuild our life. And we'll finally forget. How can I forget that my two sons died because of me? I loved them more than anything in the world. Even your wife? But I couldn't protect them. I want you to give me a child. Gross. 
This is not the time to bring it up either. Boy with your eyes. This is not the time to bring this up. And we'll watch him grow up together and we'll be happy. Yeah, this is we'll get through this. Have later. this conversation later, lady, yeah. not at the grave I'll of his fucking on. kids. Yeah. I'll be there to help. Just... Wow. Yeah. We'll get through this nightmare together. I love you. Just give me a few more minutes, Madison. This woman might actually be a sociopath. I mean, I'll catch up. Maybe. You can call him Sean if you want. <laughs> you can call him Sean if you want. Wait, Jesus. <laughs> David Cage. She's like, did I fuck up? That's a gun. Yep, maybe you shouldn't have brought up... <sighs> Holy fuck. Yep. Dead. Let's make that new chowder into a Sean's grave, baby. Yeah. Don't Dude. you love how artfully it goes in one side of his head and outside yeah. the other, just beside Dude. his eyes? Do you like how? It. Do you like how his face <laughs> is literally the same face that he looked at at, at the TV? And he's just like... Am I the coolest? What you say? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, well, but I've oh you can you imagine the, the Sean glitching in this scene? Sean! God. <laughs> My fucking god. That's uh, one, but there's one with a noose. Well, I, I think I'm done with looking up the endings. Are you? Well, I'm, I'm yeah. pretty fucking done, yeah. You know what? That can be the canon ending. I'm okay with this. Everything's fucked. Life's fucked. That's just how that is. Yep. That's just, that's just how it is. Can I go back? Thank you. All right, guys. That was heavy rain. It was pretty heavy. <laughs>